and we're not live. <laughs> but we are as good as live. We are. Because this video is coming out um, at a time when everybody, well, a lot of people, mm -hmm. want to know about Benifer. Ben and Jen. Yes. Jennifer, Jen and Ben. Jennifer, <laughs> Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck. Right. And I did do a, uh, a past life. I just found a, a past life for them that directly affects this life. There's several that they had together. Okay. But this one more so affects this life and what you're doing. So, Spanish life. So they were in Spain. Yeah. And it, I know it feels like I've said this before, but it was like Ben started from nothing. He started from nothing and worked his way into where he was a, a significant um, leader in the community in terms of he built up a ranch from nothing. Had to learn the way of doing it. I mean, but he was so smart. He's had so many smart past lives. It's just not, it's, it's usually we try to do like every kind of um, aspect of our um, intelligence kind of thing so right. to work things out. And his is like still like very intelligent to like genius. Wow. It, that's his range kind of. But in this lifetime, he was, he knew business inside and out innately, in, um, intuitively, not innately, Got but you. intuitively. Wow. So he, uh, knew the land he worked on the land he knew how to you know because he started from the bottom up so he learned and watched he watched everything he was very quiet but he knew what everything he knew everything that was going on and remembered everything wow. his memory is like impeccable That's interesting. i hope he has it in this life i think he does so he started from nothing he built himself up and he uh had a nickname that he had a golden thumb Instead of like a green thumb, he had a golden thumb because he just said gold, gold. It's just, it just was there. Was it like everything he touched turned to gold? Turned to gold, thing? but there was gold on his land. Wow. And he, some, I don't know how they found it, but yeah. And it was like, they told him that this land would never prosper. Oh. He bought bad land according to them, but he knew something. Yeah, so, and he does that in this lifetime. He hasn't utilized it as much as he should, mm -hmm. but now that he's older and he's found himself with the help of someone, because together they are magic. Oh my God. They just didn't believe it in this lifetime. But um, he met Jennifer on a trip. She was not from Spain. He met her on a trip that he went to some a business meeting kind of thing where you, they take you in their home and they kind of wine and dine oh you. Oh my gosh! Kind of thing. Did you feel what kind of culture or country it might have been? It was in Europe. Okay. Yeah. So I I, it's, I get more like it's Englandish kind of area, but um, yeah. And so she was a servant in the household in that man's oh my whatever it was. Gosh, yeah. really? Yeah. She was a servant. But this guy was not a nice oh, person. Wow. I mean, he was a powerful man in Europe. Right. Yeah, he, he had amassed wealth and he was powerful, but he didn't, he, it went to his head. Right. Yeah. Kind of, sort of like, yeah. Mm -hmm. But she did something. Um, she broke something or she spilt something on the guests or, you know, it was yeah. just a, like she was bumped. It wasn't like she was clumsy, but it, she was bumped or something oh, happened. No. Run, Jen, run. <laughs> so he slapped her in front of everyone. And then he was going back to, cause she fell to the ground when he slapped her so hard, she fell to the ground and then he was going to keep hitting her. Oh. And Ben stood in front of her and, and stood up to this man. And there was, uh, oh, and this wow. man was not to be messed with. And he's not used to people messing with him. And, and he's in Ben's life in this lifetime. <gasps> oh my gosh. That was kind of like steered him wrong ways and kind of thing. <gasps> oh not Matt. Gosh. No, no, no. Matt and him are very close. But um, he knows who it is. But uh, he stood in front of this guy and 
he had this smile on his face, bended, and he was looking at this guy and this guy knew he meant business. It's like, you know, kind of don't mess with me kind of mm. look, but it was like alpha males know another alpha male. Mm -hmm. And he knew this alpha male he couldn't beat. You go, Ben, go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so he let, you know, Ben took her and said, I'm taking her. She's my, she's my, um, she's going to work for me now. Oh, heck yeah. And the guy, you know, it's just like, whatever. I love it. Yeah. So, so awesome. But, um, he was taking her to the ranch and then, but somehow I, I guess it take, it took like several months to get back or something. Right. Because of the travel or whatever, mm -hmm. but it took a couple of months or something to get back home. In the meantime, she was with him. <laughs> so they fell in love. Oh, they so fell in love. So when he went back home, uh, his staff at first did not like her. She was different. She was dark skinned. She didn't look like them. They didn't know what this person was about. And he was a, how, how do I say it? A devout bachelor. He had no oh intentions of marrying gosh. in that lifetime. None. He was oh business, God. business. You know, of course he had relationships. I mean, he's not, right. he's human, right? Yeah. But he was, he never found anyone that he wanted to share his life with until her. Oh my so, gosh. Yeah. I love this story. Yeah. So she started, you know, being who she was in that lifetime and the staff started to love her, Aww. right? But this European man oh, no. did not forget what Ben did. And he tried to um, okay, to ruin his business. He, did, he tried to ruin his connections or somehow ruin his business and almost did. It's like, let it go. Yeah, it's something to do with Jennifer. He was, it was like he turned the tables, like it was him that was abusing and took him, took the servant away from him and was treating her horribly. He, he turned it around. Uh -huh. But um, with the help of oh. Jennifer, he got his business back, going back and thriving even more than it was. And this, um, and they lived happily, I guess you could say into the sunset oh and gosh. happily ever after. They only have one child in that life and they named him Mateo oh oh my gosh this is really sweet Matt Damon oh my god was his son and so in this lifetime if Ben seems overly protective of him mm -hmm. or feels over that's why they had this and he was his dad's right hand person oh. this yeah. is so like yeah. so cool I love this story and the European guy on his way back to where his home was, he was lost at sea. Oh, talk about karmic boomerang. <laughs> lost at sea. He just pissed off too many people. One too many. Mm -hmm. The boat came back, but yep. somehow <laughs> he was on it. <laughs> right. Right. Wow. So there you go. So, oh God. Ben, Jen. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to get together in this <laughs> lifetime and you can fight it all you want. But you're meant to be together. Look at the magic mm -hmm. that can happen. And they're going to do so much. If they stay together, they're going to do really good things in terms of helping people, not just, you know, to make themselves rich or whatever, because they will, but they really are in for, they're helping the community, whatever. They did what they did back in that lifetime. They're amazing, beautiful souls, but together they're even more. Yeah. They amplify each other. Yeah, yeah. Well, awesome. And it was called Spain. I don't know if it was called Spain then, but it's it's a little, it's different, but it's it was like Spanish. I don't know mm -hmm. back geography, but it was, I just say Spain because that's what it looked like. Right, the, right. You know, and how they spoke and all that kind of stuff. Wow. Yeah. What an amazing story, a beautiful love story. And it's so fascinating that you were saying too, that Ben knows who this man mm -hmm. is in this in lifetime. lifetime. So, oh, and he so was a person of power over his career in this lifetime. Really? Yeah. Wow. Not a good guy. Mm -hmm. Doesn't sound like mm -hmm. it. Because some things... But he's not around anymore. 
Good. So he's learned. He got him out. Mm -hmm. And now it's time kind of, to kind of guess. Be in the mm -hmm. off in the sunset <laughs> with Jen. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you might as well stop fighting it, guys. Mm -hmm. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. That's an awesome story. As long as they don't care about what anybody else thinks. I mean, they're old enough now. Yes. They they can just be together and be happy. Just yeah, let go of any judgments. Whatever. Because you know, at first, like you said, when she when they came back, the his the people around him didn't, didn't like, like her. her. Mm -hmm. But she didn't let that stop mm -hmm. her. She shined in who she was mm -hmm. and just like now they can let that go and just yeah. be happy. Yeah. Well, a little reminder real quick before we go. Mm -hmm. This upcoming next weekend, we have an evening with Angus. Correct. So if you want to find out where the F your spark is, <laughs> what the F your spark is. Yeah, what the F, not where. <laughs> yes, you can sign up. And you'll find all that in our links below. Yeah. So It might say where, but we really meant what. Yes. <laughs> where, what, yeah. When, whatever. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> we love you. And Vera, journey with us. Mm -hmm.